Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today's video I was a bit stumped as to what to do and then it just hit me. I'm going to do um, accounts that you should be following either on YouTube or Instagram or both. Um, these are kind of more so like preppy style accounts but not all of them are and I just thought it would be fun to do see what I'm looking at and um, maybe you want to follow these people too. I really enjoy when people do that thing what is it when they suggest other Instagrams or bloggers um, on Instagram on like Friday like follow Friday or something like that or people include this at the end of their favorites video so I thought I would just do a whole video on it um, and I also just want to put a disclaimer as soon as I started like writing down ideas for this I had such an extensive list so I'm after cutting it short. There will probably be another edition of this in the near future. It seems like this is something I'm gonna have to do pretty regularly because I found a lot of accounts that I enjoy and people that I enjoy um, watching and following. So if you're not on this list and you're like, but she follows me, um, and maybe you are a smaller account like myself, don't worry, you're probably on the next one because I had to cut it so short. Um, there was literally like a page of accounts and I wasn't even done. I was like, okay, we're just gonna take the first block, the first ones that I thought of, and that is what we're going to do today. So I will try and um, have the, what do you call it? The handle linked somewhere and hopefully link some of these accounts in the description box. Also, I'm really sorry if you're in this and I get your name wrong or you know that I'm getting someone's name wrong. I don't know. Sometimes American names are hard to pronounce. I'm Irish. You know, we have some weird ones too, so. Sorry about it if I get it wrong. <laughs> so as per, they're written in the planner. Also, if you don't follow my planner channel, you should do that. It's Anime Plans and it is linked in the description box. But let's just get started. So some of these are pretty obvious and some of them are maybe not so obvious. I didn't include some of the typical ones that if you like kind of a preppy style, you probably follow. Carly the College Prepster or you follow Kate from LoneStarSouthern.com so I didn't include those in this because you probably know but there are some ones that are like bigger YouTubers and things like that that maybe you don't follow. So first fabulous lady on this list is Ashley from the, I believe that's her name from the Richmond Prepster again I'll have that linked um it is just picture perfect and her blog is actually so good I have it linked you know it's a good blog when um, you have it like linked. If you don't know how to do that, that's a good thing. Maybe I'll like link a little tutorials to do that. It's very simple to add a bookmark onto your homepage. So I have one for the College Prepster, Daily Dose of Prep. Damn, she's not on this list. See all the people who should be on this list and the Richmond Prepster. So I can, when she's like new post up, I can just go onto my home screen and open up her blog. So that's a sign that it's real fab. Also her, she's so tan all the time. She's like wonderfully goldeny tan. And her hair is just perfect and her pictures are perfect and her blog is so good. It's just an overall great page, great blog. You should follow her. So the second person on this list is India King. And she posts like outfit of the days. I think it's like a challenge or something. She's about posting an outfit of the day every single day. And it's really nice. She has some really cute outfits and she seems like a really sweet girl. So she's definitely worth the follow. So number three are YouTubers, 11th Gorgeous. If you do not follow 11th Gorgeous, I highly suggest it. They are so funny. Um, you can subscribe to them on YouTube. Hopefully I'll be able to link their channel or you can just look up 11th Gorgeous. They have almost 2 million subscribers, I think. So they're pretty easy to find, but they are just so funny and I just love watching their videos, um, especially when you're like winding down or you just wanna laugh. They're super funny and yeah definitely suggest 11th Gorgeous. So the next two that I have are like more recent things. So there are two YouTube channels that I've recently subscribed to. Uh, the first is Rachel Briner and I'm pretty sure that's how you say her last name. She just has the most aesthetically pleasing channel. Oh my goodness. It's not like overdone though. Um, she has some really helpful tips on using a DSLR. She just overall has some really perfect pretty videos and she seems like a really sweet person so and her channel is surprisingly small so definitely subscribe to her because she deserves it it's just 
overall one of those channels where you're like how do you not have so many more subscribers this is so enjoyable to watch so subscribe to Rachel Briner the second of those two new ones is the financial diet which is really interesting also if you didn't know um I seem young to a lot of people I kind of am I'm 20 but I will be going into my final year of college this year so that's scary. And I was looking at the Financial Diets channel and um, they have a lot of tips for recent grads, people who are approaching graduation, people in their 20s, financial advice, but it's really, really good. Their videos are pretty much all under 10 minutes. They're all like seven or eight minutes, which is perfect. And yeah, just really, really good advice. They also have a blog, but I've been watching more of the videos. I have looked at the blog a bit as well, but so good especially if you are in college and will be graduating in the next couple of years yeah i would suggest looking at that this one is also not a like preppy style one uh, much like 11th gorgeous and financial diet it is cloud and victory so if you didn't know i'm a dancer and um, my background is mostly in ballet i did ballet from like five till 19 um well 18 really but i was pretty in it was pretty intense whenever i did ballet and i knew this brand it's actually based in singapore and my family used to live in singapore my dad still works in singapore and um, he's in singapore right now and it's a dance wear brand but it is she also specializes in like t-shirts anyways the point is her instagram is hilarious even if you are not a dancer you should follow she does like little i'm gonna have to find some of these I love Cloud and Victory. Her Instagram stories are fantastic. Like, you want to laugh? Follow Cloud and Victory. She, um, so it's an ethical and sustainable company as well, which I love if you're new here. I'm a big fan of things like that. And she's always talking about um, professional male dancers' abs. She's talking about like reaching for the pizza. She's, it's just so, so funny. She refers to herself as granny and it is just so good um it says post by min hashtag boss lady and short person she is a total girl boss she runs this ethical sustainable dancewear company with such funny all the t-shirts are like um may the fuete be with you like all different like ballet puns um there were a few oh the one i desperately wanted and it sold out right away it was like two years ago is i'm bringing saison back because your girl loves saisons and I just, ugh, amazing. But she always posts really funny uh, videos. And so she like captions kind of uh, ballet pictures. If you can see that, maybe it's just ballet people that find it funny. Oh, focus on me. There we go. But um, just follow her. She deserves it. It is a fab company. It's, the clothes are so pretty and the leotards and everything, but um, it's just straight up funny. Like I have to, she's one of the main reasons I made this. I love Cloud and Victory. Another account you should be following is Delaney Hogg. Is that how you'd say it? I don't know, but um, that is also just the name. Of, she's on YouTube as well as on Instagram and her Instagram is fabulous. It's just really, really pretty, you know, sunshine and flowers and beautiful things like that. Um, she is also a college student, which is one of the reasons it's most attractive to me because I am also a college student and a lot of preppy style accounts are run by much younger people and as great as they might be, it's just not very relatable for me as a 20 year old and someone going into their final year of but Delaney Hogg is, it's just a real, I think that's how you say her last name, is just double thumbs up, subscribe to her YouTube channel and follow her on Instagram. You will not regret it. Another double whammy of subscribe on YouTube and follow on Instagram is Erin Noel. And um, I just recently watched her April Favourites video. Again, like Rachel Brider, another YouTube account that I'm like, why don't you have so many more subscribers? I think she has about 4,000 now, but she deserves so many more. Um, it's an overall great channel. She does your usual beauty and lifestyle things, but it's just great. Um, highly suggest that. Also, her Instagram is so perfect and her outfits are always on point. I actually, to be totally honest, that's where I found out about this top. I think it was in a haul video or maybe a favorites video. Um, this top is from Shein and she had it and she hauled it. I think it was in a different color though. And I saw it and I was like, 
I have to have that top. So, you know, she's a real influencer, I'd say, and definitely give her a follow. So I'm on to my last two, and you can probably see why I had to cut this list short. Um, the last two are Abby Pratico, I think is how you'd say her last name, um, but her handle is Abby Main, and she is on YouTube as well as Instagram, and her Instagram is poppin'. You should follow it. You will want to go on a road trip of coastal Maine because she's always taking photos. She's from Maine. She's always taking photos there and it just looks so beautiful. Like I am lucky I do have, you know, the coast not too far away from me, but it's freaking cold here. It's freaking windy and it's just not I'm from Ireland if you didn't know, but I'm always looking at these gorgeous pictures of coastal Maine and like it's so picturesque and I'm like oh. So give her a follow and um, she also has a super cute dog and yeah overall again great again Last one I have and it's just one that sticks out like photography wise is the Navy Prep and I think her name is Liz um, her photos are just on point it's an Instagram account but it is just so perfect and just yes give her a follow. So that is it for this video. I hope it wasn't way too long. It seems like it's gonna be really long. It's 15 minutes right now. So I'm gonna make this outro pretty flippin' short. Um, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you wanna see more from me. I've mentioned it before, but I have some exciting things coming up soon. Um, right now I'm kind of in this in-between stage. I'm waiting two weeks to do um, or just like a week and a half at this point to do my last final and submit my last essay which I also have to start but once I'm at home and um, I live like three hours away from college like no big deal so I wasn't going to be doing nothing for three weeks up there so um, I just need to go up and submit that and then it is prepping for China I'm going on a mission trip to China um, and I will be documenting some of that on this channel as well as I will be going to Costa Rica and New York City with my family later on in the summer. So if you want to see that, do stay tuned and I will see you in my next video. Bye.